Yeah. Yo, what up? It's your boy Nameless, man. You know what I'm saying? Got a lot of people hitting me up, hitting my phone, hitting my messages, talking about the Jay Bundy and Nameless battle. So I'm going to just, if you haven't seen it, it's on YouTube now. I'm going to just break it down like this. I watched the battle like about five times. I say first round, I won the first round. The second round, if I would give him any round, I would say the second round was close. I don't know. I want to say I won it. That's just me being biased and me. But if I'm going to give him a round, I'd say the second round was the closest round. Third round, um, he choked or whatever. He was starting to do some freestyle or whatever. Third round, I won the third round. That's two rounds to one round, if anything. Even though I believe I, I got it 3-0. This ain't got nothing to do with Jay Bundy. I fuck with him as a person. But as far as battle rap go, it do got something to do with him because the second round, see, I'm, a, I'm I come from I'm from the '80s, man. So I really this battle rap shit. I really take this shit serious as far as like as far as like what type of person you are battling. You know what I mean? Like back in the days, you know what I'm saying? Like well, fuck back in the day. Talk about right now. Like what type of person you are battling? So the nigga recycled the verse. His second round was the best round. But he used that same shit against a dude named Briss Era. I just watched a comment on my YouTube channel and I peeped this. I'm like, okay, let me go watch this shit. And I watched the shit and I'm like, oh shit. This nigga used the same verse against me that he used against another nigga. Both of the battles dropped like a week apart. So I'm like, I don't know who condones this, but, um, you know, there's a lot of problems with the battle rap anyway, man. Like, there's too many leagues. This shit is way too oversaturated. Like, Niggas is getting away with choking. That shit, I'll never understand that. But I want y'all to go watch my battle, Nameless versus Jay Bundy. I want you to leave your comments on YouTube. And I want you to leave your honest opinions. It's obvious that a lot of people that left comments on the battle already are Jay Bundy's people. You know what I mean? 845, shout out to the 845. But everybody that left him a comment saying he won 3 0 is from 845. And that just happens to be where he's from. So, I mean, you know, it's cool to have supporters. So, I mean, I'm not mad because he got supporters, shit. I wish more motherfuckers supported mob movement as far as leaving mad comments on YouTube, but they be leaving mad comments on Facebook. I was trying to tell my people, leave them on YouTube, yo. Facebook's cool, but YouTube is where everybody paying attention. And now, you know, we don't judge battles no more because motherfuckers are scared of their records getting tarnished. So, I think we should go back to judging battles on some G shit because everybody say they won now. Niggas run around, I won, I won. Nigga, you lost. But if you know judge, if there's no judges, then I guess anybody could say that they won. The only reason I didn't like judges is because it was bias. Sometimes you go out of town and battle with a nigga in his hometown. You know, everybody go for their hometown favorite. Just like if you watch my battle with Dynamite. Shout out to Dynamite, but it's obvious that I had bars in the battle. He had bars. Everybody said that that shit was a crazy battle, but the crowd shows that they was fucking with Dynamite more than me, but it's because he was at home. DMV, like, he was at home, so... That's how it be, though. If you battle me in Syracuse, it might be like that, too, even though most of the people that battle me in Syracuse that ain't from there, it's been pretty even. Like, it ain't really been no bias shit with me because, shit, I don't know. I battle everywhere. When I went to Vegas, it wasn't no bias shit. I fuck with A-Hat. Shout out to OD. The crowd fucked with me. They fucked with Jeannie, even though he was from there. You know what I'm saying? So it's not always like that, but sometimes you get that. But, um, watch Dynamite versus Nameless, too. That shit a classic. Shout out to Dynamite, yo. Shout out to Jamaica, all that. But, um, yo, J. Bunny versus Nameless, um, bars, I had some bars, J. Bunny, he had some bars, you know what I mean, I just didn't, I didn't understand why he recycled his second verse, I didn't like that shit at all, I feel like he definitely lost 3-0 because of that, you know what I'm saying, plus the second round, personally, I don't think it was better than my second round, but people, people got their own opinions, you know what I mean, I just want y'all to see that battle, this is my update, this is my blog about J Bunny versus Nameless. All my peoples that be hitting my channel, YouTube channel, 315 Nameless, here's your answer. This is what I feel about the battle. Bang. I'm out.